Hey, how are you? So a Korean American fan and his Korean mom reached out and unfortunately his mom was laid off due to coronavirus. So she has decided to pursue her passion for cooking and start a Korean food delivery service called Mama Bay's Kitchen. And they have sent me a couple treats. We got a bulgogi rice cake pizza and spicy salted raw webfoot octopus for a little whoa that's weird action. Man, you can send an octopus in the mail. Pretty cool. Put that in the fridge for now. So I'm about to pop that pizza in the oven and thaw out the octopus and see how they came out. Let's give it a go. Whoa, whoa, that's weird. I know bulgogi is a popular beef dish in Korea. Looks like it's beef, broccoli, and then that stuff is rice cake, I believe. So it's a normal pizza crust, but we got rice cakes on it. Rice cake, they're pretty much exactly how they sound. They're little pieces of cake made out of rice that are great for absorbing flavors. They really just soak it all in. All right, I'm gonna pop this in. Don't know for how long. I'm just gonna put it in until it's golden brown. All right, I think I can take that out. Um, oh my god, sorry. I stepped off, I'm sorry I stepped on a frozen carrot. Okay, that's not the end of the world. Well, I, I didn't know what the fuck it was. Never walk around the kitchen with the blade out. You want the blade in. And here is the spicy octopus. Is it still frozen? No, it's good. Let's eat. All right, one bite. Everybody knows the rules. Bulgogi rice cake pizza. I love a good fusion pizza. And that's what this is. Best of both worlds. It tastes like beef bulgogi I've had in Korea. I don't know what scale I'm supposed to judge this on. Like, I don't know if I can compare it just to your like normal New York pizza. And I can't really put it on the Chinese pizza scale. This, this almost deserves its own scale, but it is tasty. It also, like, it has noodles on it. My friend had an idea for an egg roll filled with noodles, and he was going to call it a hairy egg roll. So you could call this a hairy beef pizza. But I guess that doesn't make it sound too appetizing. I'm going to rate it on the frozen pizza scale, because that's how it was delivered. You know, it arrived in the mail with some ice packs. It was frozen for two days, and then I cooked it. So on the frozen pizza scale... Yeah, I'm going high sevens, low eights. Maybe like an 8.2 or something because it's a lot better than most frozen pizza I have. It's interesting. So if you like Korean food, you'll like it. And even if you've never tried beef bulgogi, you'll enjoy it. It's kind of got sort of a, a sweetness to it. And the rice cakes just soak up that sweetness. Now let's move on to the octopus. I think the octopus was meant as an appetizer, but that's not how we're doing it today. In terms of octopus dishes I've had, this actually isn't that weird because it was in Korea where I had live octopus for the first and only time. That was good, except for the fact that it could strangle you if you didn't chew it enough. Like the suckers would get attached to your throat and you would choke. But this is dead. This arrived in the mail. Mmm. It's mixed in with some kimchi. Yeah. This isn't bad at all. I love kimchi. And this just tastes like slightly chewier kimchi with more protein. That's not bad at all. Octopus is huge in Korea. Final verdict on the octopus. Not bad. I probably wouldn't be going out of my way to order it all the time. Maybe it's, it's a nice little snack. It's a nice little pre-meal snack. I guess I just wouldn't want this as my 
full meal. But that's what they do in South Korea. They, they serve you a bunch of small little snacks before the meal. Usually they're complimentary. You go out to eat and they just put all these little small plates on your table as soon as you arrive. Sort of like tapas. Well, there you go. That's the review. Thank you for the food, Mama Bay. You saved me a trip to the supermarket, which we all know isn't the safest thing to do these days. So you're, you're a literal lifesaver. Yeah, this pizza slaps. Thank you. Whoa, whoa, that's weird. Really fucking weird. Holy fucking shit.